Okay, here is my quick review of the Chicago Electric 4.5 inch angle grinder model 65519. This was from Harbor Freight Tools. I bought this up in Crystal Lake. It's brand new. I just opened it up today for the first use. And for some reason the switch was not coming on. Now as you can see, I decided to disassemble it to see what the problem was that it would come on sometimes and not come on the other. This is the outside switch right here that you press down against the body of the tool itself. And by taking the tool apart I was able to determine the problem. In fact I probably um, had a clue of what the idea was because before I even disassembled it I moved it back and forth in my hand and I could hear a little bit of rattling in there. So this is the culprit right here as you can see this is the switch and it pivots on a little I don't know kind of like a, a shaft I guess you would call it and this is the one end of the shaft and this is supposed to be the other end which is actually this little piece right here so yeah on the very first use of the tool this little piece snapped off and it is so cheaply made that I don't think even if it had held together it wasn't going to hold together pretty very long because I mean this is just a very badly made pivot point on a switch I mean I know for 30 bucks you probably can't expect much but I just really wanted an angle grinder for just kind of a short period of use may I might you know use an angle grinder like this maybe three or four times in uh, 10 years at most if that but uh, yeah this one didn't even last uh, three or four minutes without breaking so my advice as far as uh, this particular model which Harbor Freight and I don't know who else carries it but the Chicago electric four and a half inch angle grinder totally horrible quality I mean the switch design itself the rest of the stuff I don't I don't really see any other real flaws in it I mean the armature and stuff like that but you know why uh, wreck a tool just because you make the pivot piece for the switch so dang cheap that one of the ends snap off. I mean, it would take nothing just to, to take a, a metal pin or something and make this just a little bit stronger so the tool could last longer. So, yeah, the switch is the weak point on this one. I would call it a, a not buy, and hopefully I can locate my receipt and take it back.